Hello friends and welcome to the video tutorial of Marketplace Web Push Notification for Magento 2. Now this is an add-on of WebGuard Magento 2 Marketplace. By the help of this add-on, the admin and the seller can send push notification messages to the subscribed customers. The biggest advantage of using push notification is its ability to deliver messages immediately to the customer. The messages can contain information like product launch, offer and sale, any update in the product and other information. Unlike the mails which may or may not be read by the user and it may land in the junk folder, web push notifications prompt and assured content delivery feature ensure that the notifications are for sure delivered and seen by the subscribed user. As long as the browser is running, a subscribed user will get a pop-up message on the top of the screen or at the footer even without opening your website. So now let's come to the installation of this module. After you have downloaded the module folder, you have to unzip it and then you will be getting the module folder. Click on the module folder, you will be getting the SRC folder. Click on the SRC folder, you will be getting the app folder. Now you have to upload the app folder into your Magento 2 root directory and then you have to run the commands. So for the commands and for the better understanding about the installation, you can also refer to the user guide. Now let's come to the module workflow. So let's move to the admin panel. Now this is my admin panel. So I will go to my store and then configuration. Now. In the menu you can see MP push notification so click here and now you have to enter your server key and sender ID so now you have to log in into Firebase console for getting your server key and sender ID so let's go to Firebase console now this is your Firebase console you have to go to the URL console.firebase.google.com and then from here you have to create a new project so you have to name it like my project and then from here you have to select your country and then you have to click on create project now your project is getting created now this is your project so you have to go to settings and then your project settings so click here and then you have to go to cloud messaging click on cloud messaging and then you can see your sender ID and server key so you have to copy the sender ID and server key and then you have to paste here and then from here you have to save the configuration now you have saved your configuration now go to your marketplace management and then you can see marketplace push notification so here you can see notification templates and send notification so first we will see notification template now you can see your notification template so these are the template for the notification so from here you can select them and you can delete them from here you can edit them and from here you can create them so i will create a new template so i will enter the title I will enter my message you have to enter the URL where you want to redirect it I will enter my URL you have to enter your tag and then from here you have to implement you have to upload the template logo now I have uploaded my logo tag URL message and title so now I will save this template now you can see your template has been saved now go to your send notification menu so I'll click here and now you can see the subscriber name subscribed from and at what time so you can see the ID you can select individual subscriber and from here you can delete them or from here you can send notification and 
from here you can select the template and from here you can select all and from here you can either delete or send notification so now let's move to the front end and first we will allow that this particular site wants to send us the notification now this is the front end so now you can see the notification I will refresh this page again and then you can see magento2.webcool.com would like to receive notification from this site so I will set it as yes and then again I'll go back and I will refresh this page send a notification template and then ID number 19 you can see the guest I have subscribed from Firefox and the day and time so I will select this and then from here I will go to my send notification and I will select this one bumper offer so you will see a notification that I will show you how to send the selected template I will select yes and then you will see the notification now you can see push notification has been sent now you can see the bumper offer this is the logo this is the message and this is why the site from where we have sent the notification and now I will click over here anywhere and then I will be redirected to the URL which I have entered so this was the URL candle stand so this module works in this way from the admin end. Now let's come to the seller end. Now this is my seller panel. So in the seller panel you can see your registered users and notification template. So I'll click on notification template. Here you can see your template list. From here you can select them and from here you can delete them. You can see the message, redirect URL, the logo tag when it was created. From here you can edit them, from here you can delete and from here you can view them. So now it is getting opened. So this is the complete view. So I'll go back and I'll create a new template. I will enter the name. So here I will enter the URL of PP statue. I have entered the URL of PP statue. I will enter my tag and from here I'll browse and upload my logo. And now you have to save. Now you can see your template mega seal has been created. Now again I'll visit the front end and I will refresh this page and now it will ask me if I want to receive the notification from the site I will select always receive notification and then I'll go to my registered users. And now you can see I have subscribed from Firefox. My name is John Doe as I'm a registered user and at what time and day I registered. Sorry, I subscribed. Now I will select this and then I will select this template and then I will click on send a notification. And now you can see push notification has been sent and now you can see your notification mega seal mega seal on BB statue via this site so I will click here and then it will redirect to baby statue product page so this is all about this add-on if you have any doubt regarding web push notification for Magento 2 you can raise a support ticket at support at Thank you very much for watching this video tutorial.